Welcome to PlayStation VR. If you've already unboxed your PSVR, all these components are lying around your room. Here's how to put it together into your very own virtual reality system. You should already have a PlayStation camera connected to your PlayStation 4, and hopefully a PlayStation 4 connected to your TV. First step, disconnect the HDMI cable from the back of your PlayStation 4 and plug it into the back of the processor unit, leaving the other end plugged into the TV. Next, take the PSVR HDMI cable labeled number one and use that to connect the processor unit to your PS4. You'll also need to connect them with the USB cable labeled number two by plugging one end into the PS4 and the other end into the back of the processor unit. Now, let's get powered up. Connect the AC power cord to the AC adapter labeled number three. Plug the other end of the AC adapter into the back of the processor unit and the free end of the AC power cord into your favorite wall outlet. With the VR headset connection cable labeled four, slide back the front right side of the processor unit to open those ports. Line up the symbols on the plugs with the symbols over the ports. Plug them in, then slide the cover back. The other end plugs into the VR headset's cord labeled number five. Make sure that the symbols line up here as well. Plug in the stereo headphones into the jack on the inline remote so you'll get the full effect. Your own studio quality, noise canceling, bass dropping headphones are fine too. No offense taken. Take a moment to make sure everything's hooked up right. Okay, now let's turn on your TV, then your PlayStation 4, and PlayStation VR last. You'll know everything's connected properly when the tracking lights on the back of the headset start glowing blue. When that happens, stand back for a moment and admire your work. You now have a virtual reality system in your home, all ready to go. All that's left is to get you ready in part three of this tutorial. For the players.